Hello people, my name is Ebube and this is an unplanned video. I didn't plan this video at all. I brought uh, some of my clients to pick luxury courts on Monastery Road, just off Monastery Road. Down there is where pick luxury courts. So when I finished with them and they've, they saw the land, they liked it, and they filled their form, they made their payments. So I, after they've gone, after I've left them, I dropped them off at uh, ShopRite. Then I just said, let me just see what is going on because i noticed that they were fixing the road from monastery road down to a town where we call moho right at the back here so i said let me let me let me let me just see what is so i drove from shop right down and if you've been on this road before you would know that you need an eight cylinder car four wheel drive auxiliary gear to ply this road that goes to because we are still selling an estate at the back here. One of our estates at the back here, Metro Bay Estate. You are still selling it. And that estate started selling at 6.5 uh, million. But that's not the, the reason why I'm doing it. Now, I drove all that way down here. And I am at the intersection. I am at the intersection that leads you to Metro Bay or takes you back to Ogombo. You understand and what i want you to see is that this road has been done see right there this road has been done i did not need an eight cylinder truck to come here i did not need a four wheel drive i did not need a auxiliary gear to come here i came here in my small checkered car and I've been able to drive all the way down. Now, what am I trying to say? And surprisingly, as I was coming, there are like eight estates that are already occupying this 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 side of the road. This, this side of the road. There are like eight estates that are already occupying it from Monastery Road. So that is to tell you that in little or no time, especially if you had invested here when there was nothing, you are a smart person. Now, not only that, right here is a major construction going on. Let me show you. Right here is a major construction going on. Major construction. And you can see, uh, I, I, was, I was trying to get access in here, but they stopped me because I didn't with my elements and all of those things. Major construction going on in here. So I spoke to one of the engineers and he was letting me know that they are building a data center here massive data center is coming in here it's an international project so says the engineer it's an international project and they've constructed a a a a, a, a an ocean blocking wall that's what they've constructed here. an ocean blocking wall you can see the the, the, the the machines that they are using in here let me you can see the machine that they are using here this is not a small project this is a million dollar project going on here and on this side here on this road this road right here that goes all that way down is where metro bay is located this road that goes all the way down is where metro bay is located and this road now see goes back to ogombo if you know Ogombo, this road goes back to Ogombo. Now, I did not need an eight-cylinder engine to come here. That is to tell you that if you see prospects in a land, except you don't have the money, then it's fine. But don't let things like the road has not been done. Eh, ah, it's bush. Eh, don't let it deter you. And most especially also when the price is right and when i mean when the price is right for example this metro bay now is selling at 17 million naira now it started sales at 6.5 in 2021 it started sales at 6.5 and i had clients who keyed into that property that time now if you come all the way if they are bringing you now and you did not when then when we we're coming here would hit different kind there's so much sand that you cannot even drive so much sand on this road that small cars see that car just came this car just came now from this road it, 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 like let me say it in, in pigeon 
they no born you well to bring this kind of car to this road six months ago. They no born you well. You go carry your car, go house by yourself. You go put her for air, but the car go drive you. Nobody go drive the car. But now look at, look at, this road is now perfectly functional. Look at, standard road. This is not this. <laughs> it's not government work, yeah. It's where they will give contractors a lot of money and they will do something substandard. Standard road. You can already drive on it now freely and yeah, they say they are going to interlock it again don't always let things like road and uh, bush uh, infrastructures that could be developed the only thing that should stop you from investing in a land is if you do your due diligence and the land is not free or government has an interest on it or you are hearing stories and at that point your heart is just telling you that this thing i don't want to go with it <laughs> do you understand but as long as due diligence has been done and it's free to be invested in, please get it. Please get it. Infrastructure will always come. You cannot stop infrastructure. People are coming up with ideas every day. When you are a speculator like this, especially when it comes to real estate, you are positioning. Positioning is very important. And as you are positioning, you just find that things will begin to fall into in fact let me now show you the one that busted my brain is that we now have electricity poles <laughs> we now have electricity poles here yeah. it did not take them two months to fix all these things it did not take them two months to now see electricity pole all the way from shop all the way from shop right down to this area that i have if they brought you here that time i am telling you except you are just an investor and somebody who who, who, who has an eye on the future you can see things you you may not you may not buy but look at electricity pole here now so electricity is coming here this is the, 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 the kind of project you cannot even imagine that it's going to be situated here it's what they are no one even thought it so i even thinking then that at least government will open up the ocean line and people will have different kind of you know recreational activities but something bigger than that, this is a data center. This is a data center. Data center being constructed here. Electricity is already here. Now, from this electricity now, they will now take from here to wherever else that is on this line. You'll be surprised that you come here in a few years time and that metro day, people are already living there. 